Hello Capricorn and welcome back. My name is Rosa and you have tuned in to Cancer Moon Oracles. Thank you for jumping on in and listening to this reading. Today I'm going to be bringing you a Valentine's Tarot spread. And what we're going to be doing is we're going to be tuning into the cards now and finding out who is thinking about you this Valentine's Day. Now, the deck that I'll be using for this reading is the Everyday Tarot. And I'm just going to wait for the cards to start popping. And here we go. Four of Wands. I just wanted to say thank you for liking, sharing and subscribing also for those of you who have interacted with my channel. Um, okay, so this person that is thinking about you could be a fire sign, Leo, Aries or Sagittarius, but it doesn't have to be, okay? Now, this person is thinking about stability. This person wants stability. This person wants security. This person wants to be able to celebrate with you. Um, I see joy, I see celebration, I see commitment, I see stability. I see this energy surrounding this person. Um, I see that you may, for those of you who are single, I see you, I see this person around you, this person, if you know them, this person could be someone that is in your environment already. So you may know them within like a family structure or through family. You could know this person through friends. I'm also seeing you could meet this person out and about somewhere in a building, okay, in a, at a venue or in a building. This could be a home. It could be, like I said, a venue. It could be even in a restaurant, right? That's what I'm picking up via this card. And, and for those of you who are single, you could be seeing this person at this venue, at an event, at a, at a function, okay? At a function, at a party, so for those of you who are single, you could be meeting someone new this Valentine's Day. For those of you who already are coupled up or who have someone on their mind, then I feel this person wants to celebrate. They're thinking of celebrating with you. Okay, so let's just grab some more cards and see this picture unfold. Okay, yep, we've got the star here and we've got the two of cups. So for those of you, I feel that this is a soulmate connection. You may already know this person, but I feel things haven't been good in the recent past or lately. Um, and to rebuild that connection, this person is thinking about, you know, going out and celebrating with you, doing something joyous, doing something fun uh, because they want they want stability, okay? They want to um, build a stable foundation with you again because lately you haven't been seeing eye to eye. Their hope is to regain, uh, regain stability within this connection. You are their hope, that you are their wish and they are following their, their, their hope and wish. They're following their joy, okay? This is an emotional connection. If you're not currently together, then just know that this is a soulmate connection, but things haven't been good or things haven't been balanced out. Things have been unstable between the both of you, but you are their hope and you are their wish. They see you as the star person in their life and they may even see you as really shining your light right now, Capricorn. Okay, they may be really seeing you shining 
at this time. They may even see you going out and socialising. They may even see you at an event or at a party and they just see you shining. But they know things haven't been good between the pair of you. And they want that stability with you again. They want to rebuild that so you come to a better place with each other. Um, this also could be a water sign, but doesn't have to be. I feel that if this person was... I feel this person is in their emotions right now. I definitely do. If in the past they were all about excitement and electricity and sparks and fireworks then now that's like that's like dissipated and now they're starting to feel their emotions regarding this connection which is drawing them back in towards you okay so i hope you enjoyed this reading capricorn until next time i'll speak to you soon